here I am again and I have some things to show you. Photoshop brushes and how fast they render. So here we go. Photoshop. High performance. Right there. Now this is a 300 pixel per inch 11 by 17 color mode RGB 16 bit document so we have this brush as you can see that shows up there it's a brush prop and I don't have anything checked except for this transfer thing. I don't know what that transfer thing means. And this. So, let's see. And build up and smoothing. Roundness, size. So a little bit of lag there. There's the pressure sensitivity. This is a bit more soft. It's like an airbrush. Thirty. It's a little harder. This one doesn't show mu as much variation in pressure, but I can clearly see it. Uh, not much lag there. This one has a little bit of stroke to it. And there's like a line, so I'll go fast. Yeah, as I go faster, of course. This brush, it's an actual brush. Let's do the size. That's uh, not bad. Let's make it bigger. Oh, you can see it just started getting a little bit. Let's have this checked. Laggy right there. that much lag it's like this flat blunt tipped one let's make it bigger you can see that right there it's nice nice black dot oh this is my favorite brush and as you can see it takes a long while it's just all that information. Uh, oh boy. Ooh, nice lines though. But that's with me. A high performance. Took a little while. Favorite brush. Let's try thickness, stiffness, angle, bristles. The length of the bristles. Oh, it's gradation there, but still, it just takes a little while. Now for this brush. <clears throat> it's like it's 25. Thirty six. It's pretty fast, it's like a calligraphy pen. Number thirty six is a flatter one. It's not as hard. I mean it's not as soft. So that means it's you have to press harder. I made the size bigger. Anyways, 36 again. Yeah. 
32. This is a nice one. It's 32. Diagonal looking brush. And then here's 25. 25. Oh, a little lag there. Okay. I hmm. wonder why that's happening. Here's 50, another diagonal brush. You definitely can't get that one really dark. Here's a pencil. It's 25, so here we go. Here's an airbrush. It's nice. Obviously you can tell that there's no tilt sensitivity here. But I love how it's inferring which direction I am um, for my pressure. Other than that, it's just, you know, you get these variable effects. That's cool. Another airbrush. Soon as 70 instead of 50. It's pretty fast. Yeah. You make feathers with this. It's really cool. And here's some brush I don't even know. It's like an airbrush. Extreme amount of detail and not much lag. I don't know which brush to try it again with. Color dynamics. Pretty cool. Anyways, now that that's over, if you all have anything else you want me to test out on the Lenovo Helix, because that's the computer I have, feel free to comment.